Hi, it's Dan here, and today I'm gonna to talk about how you can use ChatGPT to land clients. Let's dive in. Okay, so over the years, uh, being a lead gen, I've run a lot of ads trying to get clients, and I've seen a lot of my students and people inside of my community run B2B ads, and they work exceptionally well on Facebook. We have what we call a fugly ad. It's a very offer-based ad. It's a lead form ad, and it takes people through, and they book an appointment off the back of it, right? And that's you know worked very well, and for most industries, you can get leads for less than 20 bucks, and um, you can get conversations for kind of about 40 bucks if you look at a 50% show up rate when they're booking appointments, all right? Works very, very well. But what I've discovered over the last kind of six months as um, AI has kind of come into the scene is that most clients that, that we kind of want to deal with, i.e. people that buy leads, uh, have really got um, a problem when it comes to getting in contact with their leads, okay? So before we can deliver leads, we need to solve a bigger problem, which is making contact with the leads. And that's where um, AI has come in because there's plenty of like tools now, we have one of them, which allows leads when they come in to be contacted immediately and chat with the AI to be, almost be like a, a, a human, right? And they can book into a, a calendar, they can send an offer, they can do lots of cool stuff, right? They can qualify prospects. And what we've discovered is that rather than trying to sell our offer in our ads, which is, you know, pay per lead or, you know, whatever that might be for you, we can actually sell the experience of AI and how it would work for the client, right? And the way that we're, we're doing this is by writing an ad that says something like, are you struggling with speed to lead, out of hours leads, hiring appointment setters that get sick, all that type of stuff? Well, if so, we've got a solution for that. I'm not gonna sell you anything, I'm just gonna ask you to experience it, right? And this is a very, very good way to get in the kind of uh, headspace of clients that are sick of being sold to, okay? So it's kind of flying under the radar. They're able to experience something new, which is really hot, ChatGPT, and they're able to see how well it works for their business, right? So at the moment, we've been, I think we've been running ads for the last probably 10 to 12 weeks now. Our cost per lead has consistently been about $3. I think we've got about 18,000 leads on our of B2B leads in our system right now. And they're going through and experiencing the Android, right? And what's great is that we're able to then get their phone number because they need to give us the phone number to experience our AI. We call it sales Android, by the way. And once we have that, we can then follow up via SMS and create offers for them, okay? So the obvious offer that we're looking at after they opt in and experience AI and how well it works is to sell them AI inside their business. So it can solve all of the problems that practically any company that buys leads or needs leads to survive has, right? This is a really monumental shift um, in the marketing world, I believe. And there's a big opportunity to do that. So now we're running ads where it's the same thing, where we're, we're kind of asking them to experience if they're struggling with these things and saying, we've got a solution for that, but I'm not gonna sell you anything. It's a lead form ad. We get their name, email, and phone. They go through um, the lead form and then they get an SMS, which instigates our sales Android. And then the sales Android chats to the business owner and uh, either books them into an appointment or sells them an offer or gets them to respond. And we've got something at the moment where we're just asking people to respond with the word sales Android. And then that gets sent to my sales team and then we can book an appointment, qualify them out or whatever we need to do from there. So there's lots of different things you can do and there's lots of different things you can sell these business owners over time. If you're getting $3, $3 leads, and getting them into your system, into your ecosystem, into your CRM, then you've got them for life and you've got their phone number and you can just start selling them and well, yeah, selling them lots of different stuff and helping solve their problems over time, right? I've always said that when you're running B2B stuff, um, if you can break even on the front end and you can have a big and build a big database like we're doing, then you're gonna be really kind of in a good position. For example, we can send out an email and ask them to subscribe to our YouTube channel Okay, we can send out another SMS that says we've got an offer where we're doing a done for you sales Android at the moment and we're gonna charge you 5,000 bucks for it. Okay, and then you'll be surprised how many clients come back and wanna do that. So there's a load of different stuff. I'm definitely rambling right now. What I'm gonna do is very quickly um, pass you over to my account manager, Graham. He's gonna probably just go through a really quick screencast video. I'm gonna ask, I'm dropping him in it now. He's not in the office, but um, I'm gonna ask him to do a quick 
kind of flow through of what the ads look like and then what it looks like when the leads come in um, to our CRM. We, we use high level for this and how it converses with the prospects and then books them in for whatever. Okay, so over to him. I hope you enjoy it and see what we're doing and um, I'll see you after the video. Take care. Hey guys, thanks Dan. I'm just gonna quickly um, run through the kind of flow of our ads to chat demo for our AI sales Android. So here's one of the ads we're running right now. You can see it's live at the moment. Uh, getting about two pound leads right now. Uh, go on here. Now you might not be able to hear the, um, the sound of this, but basically it's like a real ad like this. Uh, we're just doing this, this particular campaign is just the reels and stories. Um, basically UGC content, but Dan doing it. Um, and then, you know, kind of like the, the nice captions that come up with a call to action at the bottom. And then if we just go into it, it's just going to a simple lead form. Um, just to show you quickly. Um, so you've got your banner image there, you've got a headline and a uh, sort of description paragraph. So you're basically just trying to get people to demo our sales Android. Um, and up here, you wanna make sure that, you, like we, you mentioned that they have to put in a valid number. Um, otherwise, they can't experience that so Android because it's all about SMS in between it. And then on the last uh, step, which is basically making sure people check their phone for that first text and text back, try and make it a bit fun, um, as you can see. Uh, we'll also send out an email as well so they can try it with the email. I'm just basically trying to build up a little bit of uh, excitement for them to actually try it out because once they try it out and it works well for them, um, that's when they're going to be um, ready to buy, basically. Um, so once they've done that, just to show you what the conversation looks like, this is one of our kind of test leads that we've gone through and done. That's, that's the first text that gets uh, gets sent out. This is for our kind of like our solar panels um, client getting business. Um, oh, I was a fake e e email we put in, so that's why that hasn't been sent. This is a real number. So here we go, yes, we can reply yes. And then this is when the AI, this is all AI generated in the blue. Um, so I just make sure it's to ask them out and qualify them out. Um, so just scroll through this for a little bit. Ask them the qualifying questions that we've prompted the AI to do. Um, and just to show you, it can it can um, deal with questions that are outside of its prompting, which uh, you know a binary chatbot can't do. So for example, when it asks for the postcode, I've asked back, "Why do you need my postcode?" and it tells you exactly why. Um, uh, and that can basically get over some objections within the messaging without a human having to get involved. Um, and we can go down, heard, so look at help, is this true? And then it'll come back. So it's very, very conversational, um, which is obviously very good when trying to, to sell, a pro sell a product rather than just having, you know, the linear chatbot where it can only answer certain questions if they say a certain reply, that kind of thing. Um, I know, I, I don't know about you guys, but I, I absolutely hate those things. Um, and yeah, and it even shows a little bit of empathy there, which, wow, that's quite a lot, we understand your frustration. And we can definitely, and these these aren't, these um, responses aren't inputted anywhere. It's just the AI doing it itself. Uh, we've just said what we need for them to qualify and they're making up their own questions and doing that kind of stuff. So that's pretty cool. Also, we've uh, put in a lot of FAQs in there. Um, so when we ask, do you have any questions about outside before we share the booking link, um, we actually um, have a lot of FAQs. So if they ask certain questions, they'll have a good answer back for them. Um, which is shown here, how can they last? Like, Da, da, da. No, that's it, thanks. And once they're done, uh, push them to book a uh, book a call. Obviously, <clears throat> this can either be done by just sending out this um, link or it can be connected to the um, high level chat, uh, AI chat, uh, AI appointment booking bot, which is called Eliza. Uh, but then you can pass it over to that bot when that will um, ask them what time they want the call, what day, all that kind of stuff. We've just done a, um, a little link here um, for now. And then, yeah, we'll, we'll book a time now. Thanks, wonderful. Um, so yeah, that's kind of like the flow of the of the, um, the conversation. Uh, works very well. Uh, 
So, yeah, guys, that's the that's the flow. Hopefully that you understand the power of it and it all makes sense to you. If you have any questions, then just pop something below and I'll be happy to answer. Uh, but yeah, cheers, guys. Okay, so thank you, Graham, for doing that. Hopefully um, you guys and girls can see the power of what we're doing here. It's so cheap to get people in. In fact, we've got a student that's come into our, we call it our Rent Your Android group and she's advertising to dentists and she's getting a one pound lead. She's over here in the UK and that's dentists giving you their phone number for one pound. It's like incredible. It's just such an um, amazing opportunity at the moment. We've got a demo link where you can, it's below this video in the description, you can click it and then you can go through and you can experience the sales Android uh, as well and see how it kind of qualifies you out. You can try and break it, do whatever you want with it. Sometimes it does break, I'm gonna be honest with you, but um, we're at a stage here where things are moving quickly and things are getting better. Um, I'd love for you to give it a go and see if you and see if you can experience the power of what we're what we have at our fingertips now. Also, if you'd love to um, get more of our content like this and be the first to know, um, please subscribe to our channel. If you've got any comments about what we're doing or questions, please comment below in the description box. And lastly, give us a thumbs up so we know to create more videos like this. I'll speak to you soon.